Order for Edmonton Strategy. Speaker, this government, like the outgoing Alberta Conservative dynasty, remains stubbornly blind to Albertans' frustration with the over-reliance on the boom and bust oil economy. Albertans are suffering layoffs in the tens of thousands of workers, including in the oil industry. The Conference Board of Canada reports that Alberta's GDP will continue to contract this year. Everything but the kitchen sink was thrown into this government's omnibus budget bills, yet they remain misers in supporting the 21st century energy sector, renewable energy. Where is the action to end perverse subsidies and instead incent a clean energy economy? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Natural resource development contributes 1.8 million jobs, 52 per cent of our exports, and $30 billion annually in royalties and taxes to governments. But that member and her party just don't get it. They oppose all oil and gas development. They oppose mining projects. They oppose nuclear energy. They even speak out against the forest sector. Mr. Speaker, on this side of the House, we are focused on creating jobs and growing the economy. The Honourable Member for Edmonton Stratford. Well, perhaps not in Canada. If ever there was a time for investing in a diversified economy, it's now. One weeps to consider the wasted millions of dollars on ads and U.S. metro stations that could have assisted our technical schools to train and provide jobs for young Canadians deploying cleaner energy. Instead, a growing wait list for these programs. Does this government just not get it that Canadians want to share in the economy of the future? created through investments in a clean, renewable energy economy. Here, here. Mr. Speaker, energy efficiency improvements have saved Canadian industry $5.6 billion, the equivalent of 27.5 megatons of GHG emissions. Our government has made significant investments to promote clean energy projects that protect the environment, create jobs, and grow the economy. We are proud that Canada relies on non-emitting sources for 79% of our electricity mix, one of the cleanest in the world. 